What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm continuing my series on what I keep in my backpack when packing the backcountry while bow hunting. Uh, today is, I'm going to tell you about one of the most important things in your bow hunting arsenal and that's optics. Uh, more specifically, these are the Vortec Crossfire 8x42 binoculars. Um, if you're not familiar with the numbers on binos, uh, the 8 is, if you're looking at something out in the distance, this is going to make it 8 times closer. That's what the 8 refers to. The 42 refers to the uh, size millimeter lens down here on the big end. Uh, I'm a fan of the 8x42s uh, versus the other ones. Just seems for bow hunting that this is like the best overall uh, general binocular for, for all uses. I did used to use the 10x42s, but I can tell the difference with these and the ones I was using that the 10s being that much closer were just a little shakier. And a lot of times when you're bow hunting, you have a bow in one hand and binoculars in the other and you're one hand in it. So uh, I like the stability of these, They're really, really nice. Um, they have a rubberized outside, so you get, always have a good firm grip on them. It's a nice strap that comes along with it. The uh, eye cups on the end protect the lenses that are multi-coated and it's a roof prism setup, so uh, makes them more compact and still get good light and good power. Um, they have caps on this end also that are really nice. That they have eye, the eye reliefs here, the, they're adjustable eye cups. So if you wear glasses, you can adjust these and, and still get good vision through them. Um, they have adjustable diopter right here for your eyes if you're, uh, say, your eye dominance. You can adjust this and it, it helps if you have one eye stronger than the other one or vice versa. That helps balance that out when focusing. And then, of course, your focus wheel up here, super smooth, it adjusts both barrels uh, to get you in focus. Super good, good, good glass. I can't say enough about the glass in these. Really, really nice. Let a lot of light in. Uh, I messed around the other day, had them both out. My old lens started to get dusk out, couldn't really see through them. Of course, they had a smaller millimeter down here on the end. These really let the light in. They are nitrogen gas purged, and that keeps them fog proof. They've got nitrogen gas that they pump in here that, that keeps them fog proof, and it works good. You know, that's important in those early mornings when you're sitting out glassing. Uh, your breath's coming out, the fog, and it, it's, you're not constantly wiping them out or trying to hold back and forth and try to see what you're looking through. That it kept them nice and, and clear, crystal clear. Um, they also have, Vortex has a, uh, it's called a VIP warranty, which stands for Very Important Promise. And that states that if they can't fix these, if something happens to them, they'll replace them. And they stand behind that warranty. Um, I haven't had to use it yet, thank God, but uh, from what the reviews I've seen, they stand behind their product really well. Good customer service, good American-made product. Um, something else I liked about these is they have an uh, um, adapter that you can get, so if you want to set them on a tripod. A lot of people that hunt out west, uh, you're spending a lot of your day glassing, and the comfort level is important. So. A lot of people get a tripod, they'll set them on tripod and, and, and view all day long through these things. And um, that makes it a lot better for people. So uh, I like them, it's good overall. I do a lot of whitetail hunting. I like to keep these with me. They're, they're comfortable and they stay out of the way fairly well when they're, they do make a case that wears on your chest to, that Vortex makes, that holds these super nice, high quality. Um, I love them, they're great. I'd highly recommend them to anybody looking for optics. And uh, that's what I keep in my packs. So that's my review on these. And stay tuned. And don't forget to like and subscribe down below. And uh, I'll keep the videos coming. Uh, leave comments. Let me know what I can do better or maybe some products that you want to see. And uh, again, thanks very much. God bless.